Okay, so I've had a request uh, from one of you guys to please uh, take a look at how to run Brutal Doom um, on GZ Doom on a Raspberry Pi. Um, and that's exactly what we're going to do tonight. So if you followed my video on how to install uh, GZ Doom onto your Raspberry Pi, then you should have um, it already installed and ready to run. So what we'll do is we'll just open up Doom. And uh, I'll show you how it works. Bog uh, standard Doom 2 running nicely. Uh, I'll forgive my monitor because uh, my screen capture because it does have a little bit of tearing. Okay, that's something that's just part of it, unfortunately. So that works great. Um, but what if you want to run non standard mods into your GZ Doom? Um, so what I'm going to do is uh, we've got a little file here called brutaldoom.pk3. Now it's not called that actually when you download it, um, but I will put a Dropbox link into this uh, description, which has got the necessary file here to run the version that I'm running. Um, you can then save it to your own drive and away you go. Um, you will need nothing more than this file to run Brutal Doom on top of your standard Doom wads, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on it and we're gonna go open with application and choose GZ Doom as the default, okay? So I've already done that and it will show there, but I will do it for you just now so you can see how it's done. Um, so all you do is you scroll down your list, it's in alphabetical order, you find GZ Doom. Now I've got two versions. Okay, so you then click on it and use this as default kind for the PK3. That is great. Open. Now, it'll then say which WAD you want to attach it to. Well, we use the Doom 2 we just opened and click it. And a couple of flickers. Here we go. New game. Start the rifle. Let's play. Hi. And we're good to go. As you can see, we have now got through to do. Running really well. We missed it up the nose. They do and wants to get into something a little bit more tricky. This is the way forward. Okay, it makes the enemies faster, it makes the level harder, and I got it. Amazing. Well, there you go. Not a great demonstration of my gameplay, um, but at least you can see that it works brilliantly. Um, so, hope this has been of help. If it is, like and subscribe a comment in the description uh, for me I'd love to hear from you guys if you've got any questions or there's something you'd like to see run um, I'm using Twister OS on a Raspberry Pi 4 8 gig um, this has got an overclock to 2 gig um, and I'm running an SSD uh, not essential to play GZ Doom though you can run it on a standard SD card without any overclocks it will run just all right but um, thanks for your time hope this has helped just right click once you have it set up and say open with GZ Doom and your brutal doom will start straight up. Okay. Um, thanks and good night.